Hello everyone, this is Barb at Mystic Door Tarot and thank you for joining me today. Please be sure to subscribe to my channel, hit that like button, and share your comments or questions. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. So now, let's take a look at the cards. And this is your tea leaf fortune card reading for today, Saturday, February 13th, 2021. So take a moment and see which card you're drawn to. And that's going to be your tea leaf fortune card for today. And let's just bring this in a little bit closer. Okay, that should be pretty good. Is it going to be one, two, or three? What are you drawn to? If you picked card number one, here is your fortune. And you received teapot. Deep friendship with someone of the same sex. So looking at our card, we see a teapot decorated with fruit and flowers and is filled to the brim with hot tea. A swirl of steam escapes from the teapot spout. So the teapot is indicating sharing and giving, and this card signifies that you either enjoy or will enjoy a deep friendship with someone of the same sex. So first message coming through is this is someone that you have recently met or hooked up with or soon will be coming into the picture. And this is someone that has a lot in common with you, a lot of the same interests, but most importantly, there is one specific element that you have in common with this person. Both of you feel very passionate towards this same particular thing or interest. And this could then develop into some kind of partnership. And it might end up going off into some kind of business venture. That's what I'm picking up. So it's going to be a lifelong bond with this individual. So take note of whoever this might be, because not only is this going to be emotionally fulfilling for you, it's also going to be financially beneficial to you as well. Now for others, this is a person you've known for a long, long time. Someone that you have history with, possibly as far back as your childhood, starting the friendship very early on. And no matter where your life is taking you, you stay connected to this individual. There might be long lapses of time as both of you might not be living as close to each other as you used to. But you still keep in touch, usually through social media. So with this card showing up today is a reminder to strengthen that connection. Get in touch with this individual if this message resonates with you, as some advice might be needed by one or the other of you. And so this connection will be very beneficial to you at this time. And if you picked card number two, here is your fortune. And you received Mountain Road. You're on the road to success. Looking at the card, we do see a road, snakes around a mountain. It's full of tight corners and hazardous curves, which must be navigated with care. So this is symbolizing that you're on the road to success, but success is only guaranteed if you follow the road extremely carefully at all times. You cannot veer off in different directions and still expect to succeed. So the first message immediately coming through is trying to do too much at once. This is what I'm going to say the Seven of Cups energy where you have so many thoughts and goals and ideas, but you need to focus on where you're at at this moment. And in this case, you need to focus on the road to your success. So what is the first step that you need to do with whatever it is you're involved with, whether it be a relationship, a situation, a job? You need to focus on that first step, and that might be obtaining a job or introducing yourself to a person you're interested in. That's the first step you need to focus on in order for you to succeed. Now, for others, 
This card has the intensity of the chariot card in the tarot to stay focused on your goals, not to veer off path, not to let anyone have you take a left or a right turn. So it's staying true to yourself, staying true to what it is that you want at this time. So disregard the opinions and viewpoints of the people around you as they might have more self-serving viewpoints on what it is that you truly want to be doing. If you stay on course, your true course, you will be focused and get to the end of your road, the end of your journey, and you will obtain the success in reaching the goal that you intended to. And if you pick card number three, here is your fortune. And you received lobster, financial pinch, Well, looking at our card, we do see a lobster just waiting for its victim ready to attack with incredibly strong claws. So this card's advising you to be especially responsible in dealing with your finances for today and around this time frame, because failure to do so could result in a very severe financial pinch. First message coming through is an impulse buy for some of you. Best thing you can do is wait 24 or 48 hours. And if you still feel that you want to make this purchase, then do so. But during that time frame of waiting, consider the repercussions of making such a purchase. Now for others, the lobster card is showing up as you need to be fully aware of money going out. Who is spending what? And also, taking into consideration how much money is coming in. The message coming through is someone is being a little bit more carefree with money at this time on things that would be considered frivolous, not a necessity. So this card is your warning to pay attention to your finances today and around this time. Thank you so much for joining me today and please subscribe and return tomorrow for another look at your tea leaf daily fortune. For private readings, click the website link below. Love and abundance. Until tomorrow.